Understanding Muggy in English, a guide to weather terms. Hello, everyone. Today, we're diving into a very common, yet often confusing, English phrase. The air is so muggy. This phrase is all about the weather, something we talk about and experience every day. Understanding how to describe the weather in English is not only useful for daily conversations but also enriches your vocabulary. Let's explore what muggy means and how you can use it in your conversations. Muggy is an adjective used to describe very warm and humid air, but not just any kind of humidity. We're talking about the kind of humidity that makes you feel like the air is heavy and almost wet, making it uncomfortable to be outside. This word perfectly captures that feeling of walking through air that feels thick and almost tangible. Unlike simply saying, it's hot, muggy, adds a layer of meaning that implies heat combined with high humidity. Let's put muggy into context with some examples. I didn't want to go for a run because it was so muggy outside. This sentence shows how the mugginess affects someone's decision-making because of the discomfort it causes. The forecast says it's going to be muggy all week. Here, muggy is used to describe the weather condition over an extended period, indicating a prolonged period of humidity and warmth. After the rain, the air became really muggy. This example highlights a common situation where mugginess occurs, often following rainfall when the sun heats the wet ground, increasing humidity. Understanding how to use muggy in a sentence will help you communicate more effectively about weather conditions, especially in regions where high humidity is common. It's always helpful to know synonyms to enrich your language. Other words that can describe similar weather conditions include Sticky implies a similar sense of discomfort due to humidity but can also be used to describe physical touch. Oppressive This is often used to describe extremely uncomfortable weather, both in terms of heat and humidity. Sultry usually refers to hot and humid conditions but often with a connotation of being pleasantly warm. Sweltering emphasizes extreme heat and humidity without relief. Each of these words can add nuance to your description of the weather, allowing you to express exactly how you feel about it. I hope this video has cleared up any confusion about what muggy means and how you can use it to describe weather conditions. Remember, adding words like muggy to your vocabulary allows you to communicate more precisely and vividly, making your conversations richer and more engaging. Keep practicing and don't let the muggy weather dampen your spirits or your desire to learn English. Thanks for watching and see you in our next lesson.